Hello, friends. I'm on the floor. Do you like my Ikea rug? I'm home from work. I got a cheap pizza, which was delicious. Oh, I made Valentine's graphic for a work event that's coming up, so that was pretty exciting. I went shopping for groceries, finally, because I don't do that very often. I'm wearing my low-cut shirt that I bought yesterday. Really, today hasn't been very exciting so far. I'm going to edit a video for work, and then I need to edit the rest of the video for next week's Crafting with Cocktails. Now seems like as good of a time as ever to tell you guys that I am going to be going to Harry Potter World next month. I'm so excited. So that might give you a hint as to some of the stuff that will be happening soon. And I have some really fun crafting with cocktails that will be based on some of the journeys that I have. Some days you just kind of need to build a fort. Ooh, the neighbors are dropping some mad beats apparently. I wanted to have a little conversation about bigotry. Bigotry is defined by Merriam-Webster Dictionary as a person who strongly and unfairly dislikes other people, ideas, etc. Recently, I have come across people who have been very bigoted on various things who just don't want to even think about the alternative or why other people might think a certain thing. And that always really upsets me because you're not giving anybody else the benefit of the doubt and you're not giving yourself the benefit of the doubt to actually understand something, to get a better worldview or a more vast worldview at the very least. Sure, hate something, but at least know why and know why they do what they do. A lot of times people want to have a me versus them sort of thing, and I would much rather have an us, but we're different. Huh? Am I just crazy or does that not sound preferable to not <laughs> just hate people for the sake of hating people, for not complaining about things for the sake of complaining about them? I hate when people don't think about things and they just blatantly drop it down. They're like, yeah, no, I don't want to think about it. No, no, they don't deserve my thoughts or understanding. It really upsets me. It just kind of makes me shut down when somebody does something like that. Do you guys ever shut down over anything along those lines? Because it always, without fail, gets to me. And I, I just kind of block that person out for a little while then because... I just don't know how to handle somebody not even trying. I'd say that the people that don't give other people the time of day and don't try to live in somebody else's shoes are actually worse than the people that they are hating in the first place. And if somebody who has had a very hard time with something like coming out or the other hardships in your life, if you are the bigoted one, oh my god, you disgust me. Basically. The same goes for people that don't hold the door for people. Anyway, my rant is over. How are you guys? So that's the question of the day today. What really grinds your gears and makes you shut down? Is it something like people being bigoted? Or is it something like large social situations? Or anything like that? What What is your anxiety? Leave it in the comments below. Also, fun little thing, I finally figured out how to use Google+. Plus. It's a lot easier than I originally thought, so that's a good thing. Found out, and then I took a nap. Seemed like a good idea. Sorry today was kind of a boring vlog, but I was just kind of trying to relax a little bit. Yes. So that's it for tonight, and I shall see you all tomorrow. Wink.